Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I did a video showing you how to do an airbrush makeup and I think it's very interesting. And I've received this uh, airbrush kit uh, from Luminous Air a long time ago but haven't filmed a video yet and I apologize for that. So here we have a compressor and a stylus pen. A stylus pen is a pen where you dispense your product into and then you pull the throttle and it sprays onto your skin. So first you turn on the compressor, then I have a moist primer in M1 to moisture my skin and I dispense some drops in the stylus pen and I lightly uh, spray it onto my skin. Then I have an airbrush foundation in shade 2, which is the closest color to my skin tone. And always shake well all your products before applying it. Dispense 4 to 8 drops into the stylus pen. And I start to apply in circular motion the foundation. And you have to hold your stylus 6 to 8 inches from the face. Otherwise, you will end up with spots and blotchiness. Keep the hand moving all the time and spraying lightly in circular motions, otherwise you will end up with blotchy skin. One or two layers of foundation will make you look more natural. If you want more coverage, then apply more layers of foundation. So the two layers almost completely covered my discoloration, but here I cover them even more. Under the eyes I decided to go with Dark Circle Erase by Maybelline as I think it gives me more control. Blend it with Beauty Blender. To warm up the skin, I'm using airbrush bronzer. And don't forget to shake it well. And again, in circular motions with light hand, I just apply to the hollows of my cheeks, to the temples, to the forehead, the color of the bronzer is amazing and it has a golden sheen to it, which I really like. Trying to contour my nose a little bit. Your movements have to be very precise with it. For the brush, I'm taking airbrush blush in soft rolls and apply just a little bit. And an airbrush glow in G1. I apply it where I want my face to be lighter, to the highest points of my cheeks to the center of my forehead, to the jaw, to the bridge of my nose, and cleaning a little bit the bronzer application.
To set my concealer, I'm using Secret Brightening Powder by Laura Mercier on Zeri Cosmetics Highlight Brush. To set the face, I'm using Kat Von D Translucent Powder on my Zeri Cosmetics Powder Brush. You can set your airbrush foundation with powder or not, it's up to you, but I decided to go with it because it makes me feel more safe with my makeup. The tricky thing about airbrush makeup is uh, when your product is not dry and you touch your face, you will ruin everything and it will be a pain in the ass to fix it. <music> lip product is lip mask by best damn beauty for the lips I'm taking Anastasia lip gloss in Kristen As for the highlight, I'm taking Gleam Kit by Anastasia and mixing Crushed Pearl and Mimosa on Sigma F03 brush. And this is the final look. I really like the finish and I hope you guys enjoyed it and thank you for watching. See you all guys soon. Bye bye!